Mysterious lights hovering in the skies across several parts of the country. This video is from Indianapolis of a strange formation that appeared this week. Now, people in Metro Detroit say they've seen something just like it. Last night, our newsroom and our Facebook page got several reports of strange lights in the skies over Metro Detroit. And tonight, Fox News' Ron Savage is on a mission to find out what they really are. Ron. You, oh, you know how we operate here. We do stories on talkers, and this is a talker. Everybody's talking about it. What are the lights in the sky? Mysterious lights in the sky. Many Metro Detroiters have been wondering, what am I seeing? It wasn't qu quite as high as you would see. Them. I've been watching the airplanes tonight, and it wasn't quite as high as them. And uh, I mean, like I said, you, can, you could actually see the triangle shape of, of the object. David Levy was outside Thursday night, 9.30 p.m. with friends in Flat Rock, and suddenly... We were outside, and out, up in the sky we saw a, a triangle-shaped light with... Our triangle-shaped object with about five lights flashing, heading north. Who saw it first, a friend or did you? I did, I did, yes. Yeah, what'd you say? I, I asked people, what, what do you think that is? And everybody was like, I don't know, I don't know. And then uh, later on at night, I found out that people had been seeing this object all, all over. In fact, our Fox 2 Facebook page has been blowing up with hundreds of posts, people seeing lights like Lisa. She writes, I seen some in Southgate, but thought it was fireworks and weird for January. Nick writes, I assumed they were planes. They were flying in the same direction. I watched them for about 10 minutes, and I counted four or five of them. I'm over in St. Clair Shores. Mario writes, I seen it in East Point, off Nine Mile. It was something crazy. And Sean writes, I was the one who called into the Fox 2 newsroom and first broke this story. They were black, triangle-shaped objects making circles over West Bloomfield and Farmington Hills. There was no noise, and they had bright lights. I'm not making this up, and I know somebody else saw these things. These lights are all over YouTube. The original poster says they were shot in Miami this week. And these lights were said to be shot in Indianapolis. Is this similar to what David saw in Flat Rock? This kind of looks like a stand in one spot, but that's exactly what it looked like, except there was five of them. Five lights. Five lights. William Konkoleski of the Michigan Mutual UFO Network has also been taking calls from people who see lights at night all across Metro Detroit. It's very possible that people are seeing military aircraft that they haven't notified us about yet, um, like the spy planes or the, also the stealth aircraft um, that are, have been flying on our skies now for a few years. It's well known that they were testing these aircraft well before they notified people that they even existed. Now, on top of all that, we have unmanned drones up in the sky, and those things really look strange, especially for somebody that has no idea what they could even be. And certainly some people may be skeptical when they hear that somebody's reporting lights in the sky, but perhaps there is a logical explanation for some of these light displays. They've been reported all over, all over the country, and all around the calendar, all, all year round. It doesn't seem to be a particular time of the year when they're reported more so than others. And across Michigan and Metro Detroit, we're getting reports, and our Facebook page has been blowing up, as you know recently, Hugh, with a lot of people reporting these lights. Ron, for years, the Air Force conducted an investigation of so-called UFOs. They found no official proof anywhere from the feds tonight about those strange lights. Well, you wonder if the military is involved, as one of our uh, UFO experts uh, was curious there and mentioned. We did put some calls into Selfridge. The FAA, we didn't get any reaction. Could be a logical explanation for some of these light displays. I'll tell you this, there's no full moon right now, but we're getting an awful lot of reports of lights in the sky, Huel. Certainly not a weather balloon, Ron. All right, thank you. That's right. <laughs>